iAction Result is an interface in the Microsoft ASP.NET Core MVC namespace. It defines a contract for implementing different types of results that an action method can return in an API, e.g., OK, not found, bad request. Why use iAction Result? To give flexibility to a controller action to return any kind of HTTP response. Allows the action method to dynamically decide the response type at runtime, e.g., based on input validation or processing results. Common implementations of iAction Result. Here are the typical classes implementing iAction Result and their purposes. OK Result returns a 200 OK response. Not Found Result returns a 404 Not Found response. Bad Request Result returns a 400 Bad Request response. Created Result returns a 201 Created response with a location header. No Content Result returns a 204 No Content response. Example of using iAction result is shown below in get product where return type is iAction result and from method we are returning different types like bad request, not founds product type. Here, the method dynamically returns 400 bad request if the ID is invalid, 404 not found if the product doesn't exist, 200 okay with the product data if everything is fine. Limitations of iAction result. No type safety. There's no compile time guarantee about the type of data returned in the response. This can lead to inconsistencies in API behavior. Action result explained in detail. Definition and role. Action result is a concrete class that implements iAction result. Action result, T, is a generic version introduced in ASP NetCore 2.1, which allows returning a specific type, T, along with standard HTTP responses. Why use action result or action result T? To achieve type safety, it ensures the response always contains a specific type of data. To reduce boilerplate code, you don't need to wrap a result in OK. A SP, NetCore automatically does it for you. Key advantage of action result T. Example of using action result is shown below in get product where return type is action result product and from method we are returning product type along with that we have flexibility of returning HTTP status codes product type. What happens here? If the ID is invalid, a 400 bad request is returned. If the product is not found, a 404 not found is returned. If the product is found, the product object is returned directly. ASP. NetCore automatically converts it to a 200 OK response with the object serialized in JSON. Here's a feature by feature explanation of the comparison between iAction Result and Action Result T. Definition iAction Result, an interface that defines the contract for all action results in ASP NetCore. It is the base for predefined responses like OK Result or Bad Request Result and for custom responses. Action result, T, a class that implements iAction result. It is designed to represent action method responses in a structured and strongly typed manner. Type safety. iAction result does not provide type safety, meaning the response type is not explicitly defined. This allows for flexibility, but may lead to inconsistencies. Action result, T, enforces type safety by requiring a generic type T. The returned object must match the specified type, ensuring consistency in the API response. Flexibility. iAction Result offers high flexibility, allowing action methods to return various types of responses, e.g., OK, bad request, file result, dynamically. Action Result, T, slightly less flexible as it is designed for consistent responses. While it supports different response types, it works best when the primary goal is to return strongly typed results. Use case. iAction result. Ideal for scenarios where the action method may return multiple result types dynamically, e.g., returning OK or not found based on conditions. Action result, T, best suited for scenarios where the API returns a consistent type, e.g., a model object, along with possible HTTP status codes. Response wrapping. iAction result requires you to manually wrap results using helpers like OK, bad request, etc. for different HTTP response types. Action result, T, automatically wraps the response object in an OK result if no specific wrapper is provided. Preferred usage, iAction result, 
Use when building APIs with highly dynamic responses that can vary in type. Action result, T, use when building APIs that should provide consistent, strongly typed responses, improving clarity and maintainability. How they work internally. I action result. Implemented by result types like OK result, bad request result, etc. The action method returns an object that implements I action result. A, S, P, D. Net core executes the result to produce the HTTP response. Action result, T, inherits from action result, provides a property of type T for the response data. If T is returned without wrapping in a result, e.g., OK, ASP, net core automatically wraps it in OK result. Best practices. Use action result, T, for API actions that return data as it provides type safety and reduces boilerplate. Use I action result for actions where multiple response types, e.g., OK, bad request, no content, are dynamically returned. The return type cannot be tied to a single type, e.g., mixed success slash error responses. Keep the API consistent by using structure responses, such as problem details for error handling.